So um, we are so happy that uh, President Obama is really supportive of people with disabilities. If you go to his website, he's got several sections of his platform around disability. And Kathy wanted me to be sure to mention also that it's not just about domestic issues as well. It's also about international issues, about supporting the UN, um, you know, uh, convention on people with disabilities and so which we have not the u.s has not signed on to and um, you know we haven't signed on to kobe around the environment or any other kinds of things so i think we will see a real sea change in washington as well as internationally and hopefully regain our place in the world where people might actually respect us and work with us a little bit well i'd like to say congratulations first of all and we look forward to uh a new year or years per se. Um, we're really excited that we could um, start to move forward and rebuild uh, and, and create opportunities, especially with individuals with disabilities. Working for an independent living center, I work at CRIO as a community organizer, and we are bringing people together to bring up their issues on disabilities. What is it they want to see our new president um, start to work on because we know you have a lot on your plate and with all the, the budget cuts and service cuts um, we would just want to like to offer you some ideas and suggestions to um, consider um, services for individuals with disabilities um, employment issues creating more jobs for people with disabilities health care housing, affordable and accessible housing. Um, so we, we look forward to working with you and, um, and working closely with you. Thank you. Oh, President Obama, what's the game? Congratulations on your election to be our president, but most important, I really urge you to have full support of program and services for those of us with disabilities. And most importantly, to strengthen our civil rights so that we can help full citizenship as anyone in this country, and that's what you are all about. Our President Obama, I wish you everything that you were thinking will be done in, at the time, and by the time, I wish you will help peaceful and God will help you. Okay. We love you. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Obama. I would like to see um, support for the disability community. And as a case manager, I would like to see support for the deaf, hard of hearing, late deaf community. Um, I have disappointingly seen many of my consumers, my clients, pass away because of not sufficient services and access for interpreting to hospitals. I've seen senior citizens who are deaf uh, die alone and isolated as the only person in nursing homes uh, without deaf signing staff or deaf senior citizens who are also in the same homes. I would like to see the full access and participation of deaf people in government, and uh, the only way we can have a really fair uh, government is to have fair representation, and so let's, let's bring on members of the, the deaf, of the disabled, of all various uh, communities to assist you in making this country a miracle on earth. Thank you. Great. Hello, I'm Kathy 
Martinez, and I'm the Executive Director of the World Institute on Disability. And I would like to congratulate you, President Obama, for being our 44th president and to say that everybody here at this gathering is counting on you to help us improve the lives and, and opportunities of people with disabilities. And that means for us cradle to grave necessary services uh, to help us participate in the community, become educated, become employed. Good luck with your presidency. Hi, President Obama. I'm Jan Garrett. I'm the Executive Director of Center for Independent Living, the world's first independent living center, serving Berkeley and Northern Alameda County, California. And I myself grew up with a disability, and I want you to particularly notice who's on my shirt today. I wanted to make sure that I was wearing your lovely wife um, all day during the inaugural week. So we're very proud of you, but we're also very proud of her, and we're very proud of Sasha and Malia as well. So um, I just wanted to say that please, please uh, recognize the rights of people with disabilities. Help us increase some funding, not only for the individuals with disabilities to be able to succeed and to have health services as well as um, vocational services and special education, which has been so neglected, but also in a self-interested way that uh, independent living centers would get a little bit more than we have. Um, in fact, we've been decreased in funding over the last eight years. So um, please help support people with disabilities and the organizations that serve them and you know make us really truly successful, the people that we know we can be. And we're so happy that you're president, and uh, good luck with all of your efforts. Hello, President Obama. My name is Max. I work for the Center for Independent Living in Oakland, California. Uh, people who are, who are already hurt do not need to be hurt further. It's time to turn stuff around, and let's get uh, access, housing, employment. People who can't work, better disability, better medical. And do the right thing because uh, we put a lot of trust in you, so don't let us down.